This footage was shot three days after the footage that was shown in Sonic Takes the Dumbbell. And we've practiced probably two or three times since that first video was shot. And she had started taking the dumbbell from different places around her head. And so here we start going down to the floor and seeing if I can get her to lift it. The first couple times I'm actually lifting it with her. And I just decided I'd put it on the floor. And of course she's doing some chewing of the end. Uh, but a wrong actually gets her to stop doing that and lift it up by the bar. There's a couple missed opportunities for reinforcement when she just glanced at it there. And then she put her nose, she kind of pushed it with her nose. Those could have been reinforced, but because she didn't pick it up, I kind of ignored them. I like her to be sitting, but she was it was early morning and she was sleepy and she was slipping on the floor a lot. I think that's partly why she kept lying down. Ready? Because she kept wanting to lie down, I went back to holding the dumbbell up because that helped keep her from lying down as she reached down for the dumbbell. She was also pretty slow and sleepy, and uh, I just wanted to get some more success. And I left all of this in so you can see the progression. You know, she starts pushing it with her feet and skating around the floor a little bit. And that's something that happens, so Ready. I just took control of it and grabbed the end. Oh. Ready. You can see she's starting to lie down, so I kind of interrupted that by Ready. lifting the dumbbell. Got some more nice lifts up a little higher. These last two efforts are particularly Ready. nice lifts Ready. where she's reaching down and holding on to it as I lift it up. Ready. That's just what we're looking for.